Okay, page group mam ches. And we start on the line that begins with the word of the whole sphere. About eight lines from the bottom, from the end of the top section. <coughs> so we are now talking about Oipnimi. Oipnimi is Mislabesh Begilui. Begilui means in an appreciated manner. It's recognized, it's understood. Bipnimius, internally, it's it, to, point, to a point that it's, it's possible to be internalized. Therefore, this is where we have to. Yeish bozer, therefore, there it would be. Kami hiluki madrigis. Many hiluki madrigis, many different madrigis. Beifen ha gilui. In a manner, the extent, in the, the manner of this gilui, in every, in each oil, in each world, or because sphere and each sphere, it would be different. Why? Because it has to be accepted fully internally. Definitely has to be fit perfectly to that world and to that sphere. And that will continue. Where which means that according to the manner. Of the world and the kalim where the where the oil is mislabish. Kahu ham shocho. Kahu ham shocho. This is how the ham shocho comes. Please understand the meaning of these words. <coughs> According to the world and the kalim, that's how the ham shocho is, which means not merely that because this world and this kalim cannot see anything more than it can see. Therefore, it, t- it takes what it can take. Uh, therefore, there's a difference between what one can take, one, one, one oil takes, what other oil takes, what one can take, another can take. That's not. The difference is not at the recipient's level only. The difference is at the giver's level. From the giver's perspective, from perspective. The oil pnimi is nimshech misgala <coughs> differently in every place. I'm reading the words. So if the oil from the oil lovers, I can call him hamshocha. The hamshocha itself, hamshocha means the drawing, the, pre- the presentation, not merely the acceptance. The high no, and that is. The reason that this take, that this is the, that the Amshoch itself is distinguished, is differentiated between one oil and another. This is Lefi because Shaklolos Hoir Hoir, because this oil in general, the whole definition of this oil is to be a oil is in order to take to be effective. In other words, to to affect. This oil is not merely to tell you about the oil, and then you take from it what you can take. No, the oil, Klolo's oil, the, um, the, 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 the principle of this oil itself, as it comes from its source, is big day leaf and it is in order to be effective. And therefore, since that's how the oil is nimshach, to be effective, therefore it's a nimshach <coughs> in, in different ways in order to be able to be effective. Excuse me, this is your pnimi. What does Hamshocha? Hamshocha is the Kaile Mamshach, or the oil is like like giving? No, no, the oil is giving. Hamshocha means that the oil is Nimshach from its source. The Rebbe says, Klolos ha'oyer hu b'kilif, it means it's got it yesterday. The, pr- the principle of the oil to begin with is the leaf in order to be effective. Or b'shor shehari shay. And it goes all the way back to its first, term, to the to top, to top set, uh, uh, level. 
שושי הורי שואל, אם יש פרש לאורות, where is לפני הצמצום? before the צמצום. This Indian leafoil to be effective <coughs> is not something which materializes later on when you see, oh, wait, wait a second, it's not going to be effective. You have to, you have to uh, uh, cater it according to the recipient. The Shor Shehorish, all the way before the Atimtum, before the Atimtum, already there is a cognizance of the Indian that you have to be Mamshech Oyer, that will be Bipnimius. And it is who? And it is represented and it rooted in the fact that where the oil in soif. Oil in soif, this is the, this is the market, the oil in soif. But sheer be'atzmoy. He estimated within himself, or identified within himself, the hoyer be'mido gul. To illuminate be'mido gul in a measure, in, in a limited manner. So, so it could be clueless, so it means all types of oiras, pnimi and asoyer. My dear friend, it, we're talking about oi pnimi. Clueless oyer, the clueless of this oyer, of oi pnimi. <coughs> oi maki has, has, its, has its definition. I don't know what, you, what you're shooting at. Clueless oyer means we're talking about oi pnimi right now. Oil maki is a complete, has a completely different definition, a different, different identity. Oil maki is, is, is to represent the source. Oil pnimi is to be incorporated in the recipient. You misunderstand the word close oil. Close oil refers to the specific oil. Doesn't mean oil in general. It means oil, this specific oil, but this specific oil is biklolus in its in its inception. This oil itself, <coughs> at its inception level, is the higher in in the leaf oil. Where, where is the inception level of this oil? If not it seems to me even. This is where it's conceptualized. Klolus oil here does not mean the oil in general. It means the the general aspect of this oil, ho oil, this oil. <coughs> okay, let's go back. And this is true all the way up in its very first beginning. This begins even before the Tzimtzum. Even there, there is this Indian that it should be Oipnimi. We'll discuss it after we get through this. Who so <laughs> it is? Masha oil and soif, sheer be atzmai. It is that oil and soif itself. To remain on this call, press one. Sheer be atzmai had, sheer means measured up, or recognized within himself, identified within himself. had identified internally to itself that he wanted to come forth and to illuminate and to express himself itself. The oil in soif should be expressed itself in a measured manner. Is, is um, oil in soif is distinct from above Makif uh, No, no. Oil in soif, this is Makif Anfimi. It's what? This is, this, this is where all the oils come from. Oil in soap is makif, it's essentially. So why would why would makif have an, have an intention or a concern of being coil or being... Um... All right. So finally we get a meaningful question. <clears throat> the answer is that the whole in of gilui oil was not merely to reveal the etzim itself, but to effectuate the creation on that basis, to give to give of itself. This is what gil oyer is. Well, then it's not really gilu or it's gilu gilu yesh. 
No, no, it's Gili Oyer. But Oyer on different levels. Gili Oyer <coughs> means it has, 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 has a, is, okay, what it means, Gili Oyer means it is not accidental. It is not by um, um, happenstance. It is intentional. Every Gili Oyer is intentional. A pihorotin, as we said before. And we're still coming to it now. It's intentional. There's a rotin in, in this Gilead. Since there's a rotin in Gilead, there is a definition of what the Gilead is about. And therefore, there's a defining factor in the oil itself that's in this gal. So somehow, Makiv has the intention to be. The source of the makif, the source of the makif, the source of all the oilers. Oil in soif. Shir biyatsm, lohoi b'midu gvu. That's all, on, that's on the very source of, source of sources. Shoshu rishin lifni atzim tzum. In shoshu rishin there is both. That there should be oil in soif, makif, and there should be also p'nimi. None of it is is accidental, is unintended. Lifni Hachimtu, oil in Sorb, Shir, Biyatsmi, Lohoi, Bimidu, Gvu. Why? Because oil in Sorb wanted that in the level of Midu, Gvu, the level of world, there should be a union of boy key. To translate this all the way down to us, the very fact that we have received a toilet. And the very fact in the Torah there are mitzvahs that are instructions to us how we should behave here in this physical world is due to this to this original intent of the oil itself. It is true, it's a, it's, a, it's a divine gift, but he wanted that the, 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 to permeate the entire existence, even the world level, to be the fact that should be permeated with, with, with godliness. All the way down to, to the physical world. He gave us mitzvahs, physical mitzvahs. Put on the It's Lifnei at I mean, it's the four world that is a concern with miracle. That's right. Lifnei at Simtsum, there is not a definition of what the mitzvahs are going to be. But Lifnei at Simtsum, there is an intent that there should be ultimately it should come the midogvul itself is identified further after, further down after it seems but after it seems to it's identified because the fear seems to there was already a a a, a um, Mandate that there should be Gilu Bemido. In other words, I don't know why we have such difficulty. Well, it is the, the reason that there is a Mido Gul Yachter Tsimsu is not merely, as I said before, it's not merely going to fit to the cave. Which means it's a secondary thing. It's not intended. It's not. It's not valued. The keli receive, receiving it is not valued from a, from a higher perspective. Nebuch, you're poor, so I'm going to give it to you. Give you what you what you can what you can digest. Not so. Not so. It is absolutely intended, and it is valued. 
when you take it, when you take it motto in on a practical level in your own little world, and you perform and you do the act, the, the mitzvah according to your little world, absolutely it's valid. To the point it's valid that all the way back to the beginning. This is what I'm looking for. I want this. This is a very important distinction. And you can see it in the way your own mind is working. Say, oh, why would he be only interested in it? He is very interested in it. He wants that the Elokush should be, should be revealed at every level. And the reason that he wants Elokush to be revealed at every level is because Elokush is true in every level. So th- this is the way that Etsem transcends or Makif or or Knimi. There's an intention that precedes both of them, yes? This is true what you said, but it has to be correctly understood. Yes. But the Rotson transcends my Machu and Pnimi. Rotson is a representative of the Etzim, and the Rotson incorporate includes everything. I'm going to put it straight out on the lowest level. You have a home. It's a human abode. And this home has all the amenities of a home. It is beautiful, well appointed. You have a, a tablecloth on every table. You have armchairs all around, all around. It's beautiful. You have a hangers for, for your clothing. You have, a, you have a place to put your hat down. Everything. Pardon me. This home, if it had no bathroom, would it be a home for a human being? I'm looking for an answer. No. No. Because he does not recognize what the human being is in, in full in the full sense. A home is an accommodation with the human being top to bottom. That's when it's a home, that's when you recognize a human being. When the when when when, when oil and soap wants to reveal himself, he has to reveal he reveal from top to bottom everything that's contained in oil and soap. The bleak wool and the wool. And if it does give only the bleak wool, it doesn't give the wool, it has not, re- has not revealed it itself fully. Yes. One second, I just want to finish this this thought. Oyeni Soif is revealing itself, not in order to show its greatness. It's revealing itself in order to to give benefit to whatever he can give benefit. It's not a selfish revelation. To be recognized? Of course, to be recognized is a primary benefit to the recipient. But it's a perfectly 
selfless, quote unquote, revelation for the benefit of the recipient. And Lifni Hatimtu, Shir Biyatma Ilohoi Bimidu Gvu. Lifni Hatimtu. But there was no need for that at all. This is before it seemed so. But he was not withholding anything. If there is a possibility of God be the fool, he grants that too. Okay. <clears throat> In a way, the world the world's not lacking. But this, in this way, the world is already a dira b'tachanim, or there's something more to. No, the word of dira b'tachanim is when it's accepted b'pnimius. When you do a mitzvah, and then you're making a, a, a dira b'tachanim. When the tachanim itself. The tachten, the tabir tachten, can be built by the tachten. You cannot build a house by your wishes, by your conception of a house. You have to take mortar and brick and put it together. That's when you have dinu betachten. You're locked out, huh? Locked out. Yeah. You can't go in, you can't come out. Catch your tank on. No, uh, <laughs> Sagur. Sagur, Sagur. Why you may try then? Okay, let's go. This would have been these words. We got stuck in this word. Kolalos oil means this oil from, the, from its inception. Not later on as it comes down and you see it has to be adjusted. At its inception level, is big day leaf it is in order to be effective. Oh, hello. So, um, And it's rooted all the way up and before the symptom. She be asked the whole middle group. Internally to to early so he already had projected that the, that this oil itself could be affected by middle group. Okay. Velozois. And for this reason, this is why this oil comes and it goes all the way down in the Hislapsus manner. Why? He thinks Hislapsus. Because that is the intent of this oil. Hislapsus means intentional, intentional relationship. He recognizes the recipient, and he relates to him. He identifies him at, in, in all his ramifications, all his details. He gives the foot what the foot needs. He gives the head what the head, head needs. That's when he slaps us. This is Milamaila. This is, this is Orpnimi coming from above. This, this is the source of Orpnimi. And all that's lacking is the recognition of Milamata. What? All that's lacking for there to be any full completion of this is, is that it be recognized? Uh, what say it has anything looking lacking? You said Dirabatahtonim is when it, the when the when receiving below. actually receives it. He actually receives it. But you said that's how it says. By Chalkin, Yosef, Yosef supported with food, 
It's all because his fathers and the, and the household lechem lefi hatof. He says he gave lechem lefi hatof lechem food lefi hatof according to the young. Was it lefi hatof? He gave each generation, each level, its level of food. Lefi hatof. This is we need kilku. This is how you feed. You can't feed a, a baby a, a child. There may be something very desirable. Or meat. A baby give baby food. You try to eat baby food, see how you how you digest it. You throw it up. For a baby, you feed baby food. This is at its inception. He wanted to be to be present and to benefit every level. And this goes all the way to If it's a fiat simtum, means that there is not a matter yet to judge according to what the matter needs. There's not no matter yet. Please understand the implications of these words. So if there's no matter, how is he Mishire? What is he judging as to what to give? It means that in the oil in soil there is a source, there's a cognizance of the union from matter. Oil in soil is not is not just in soil. It has everything. Oil in soil will milo milo then ket will mato mato then tachis. The whole reality itself is is in oil in soil. And in reality there is. Everything. There's Milo and there's Mat. We had the mash of the house earlier, mm-hmm. both from the human perspective and from God's dira. But two things. One is, uh, as much as the house is suited to the human being, it's not that his essence it doesn't contain his essence. It provides greatly, but seemingly his essence is way beyond that. Not true. Not true at all. A human being is designed by the Creator that he should take food in and process it and 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 uh, throw out the, the, the refuse. Right. So the, the fact that he, he lives in different houses or that he has memories and interactions that are way outside the house, this sort of implies his essence is not contained by the house. It just facilitates his life on earth. And if this human being is a great scholar and he does not know how to behave at earth, he's not a human being. Mm-hmm. The lowest creature on earth is, is the mosquito. Why? Because it machnis vein mates. Again, I understand that there are different rooms and it caters to the lowest function, fine. But I'm just looking at the way that this somehow is indicative or, or is Short a full represent no, a full representation of his essence. And then <coughs> excuse me. Define his essence. 
his essence, his essence is a godly presence on earth. Not in, not in Ganeid, on earth. That's his essence. That's what a human being is. On earth means that he incorporates every aspect of earthliness and godliness at the same time. And that is best exemplified by the house. It's an example. Mm-hmm. This is what happened by Pera. In Mitzrayim, Pera, Pera presented himself as, as a god. And what was his means? Of, what the, yeah, he said he doesn't go to the bathroom. He doesn't no, go to the bathroom. He, yeah. And Not going to the bathroom, but yes, it's the lowest thing. Fine. And then we, we used that, and we talked about Dira, and it's in today's Tanya, this Dira Batach Tonya. So... Seemingly, you know, in a certain way, it's already accomplished, right? He, God makes, um, he reveals his infinite glory and he reveals great specificity. So, in a sense, the houses are already finished. Or no, or no there's still more to do. Still more to do. Because um, what's, what's needed exactly is this kind of what? Recognition? And it permeates the mitzvahs of the world. Permit the material world means that it should be recognized from the world perspective itself, not what God intended, but from the world itself. To be recognized from the world itself is the human being acting in a godly way on the, in the world. And, and wouldn't that recognition, in a, in a way, overwhelm the uh, mida and gvul? The, no. How no? Not at all, because he acts within mida and gvul. While at the same time recognizing infinity or that's God's right, exactly world. right. That's right. That's why a house has has a place to daven, a place to learn, and a place to uh, and a bathroom. And if it lacks any one of these, it's not a full sense. It's not a house. It's not a home. And Pharaoh, who claimed that he doesn't have to go to the bathroom. Was an was a, was an idol worshiper. Was a creeper. <coughs> Why? I want to be pure. I don't want to get involved in, in lowly things. You want to be you you <coughs> deny being a creation. You want to take the place of the creator. What kind of chutzpah is that? <clears throat> I'm glad we had this conversation. I'm a little bit taken aback that we had uh, this difficulty after the learning Siddha so much. But anyway, we got it through, I think, I hope. And if you still have questions on that, please come by, come forward. Oipnimi, this is what oipnimi, what does oipnimi mean? Pnimi means internalized. Internalized means that it fits the, the, the location. Exactly. The location means be a higher low, and a lower location. This is why I said there are two different oils. There is oil makim and oil pnimi. Oil makim is also encompassing the oil pnimi. Right. Today's, today, one of today's main points is that this or pnimi originates even before there's a lower environment. Originates at the same place where yep. the oiling surface originates. Right, because you, you may think that it comes later or it's sort of procedural here, no. Yeah, that's, that's yeah, right, exactly. That's this is not, we, we already learned it. Yes, yeah. absolutely right. Yeah. Absolutely okay. right. It's not, it's not a, 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 an afterthought. It's not a later development. It's not to accomplish creation. It's originating before creation. That's right, before it seems to. Yeah. Because... Because before the Timtu, there was already intent that oil and soil should be expressed in Midogvu, which is contrary to oil and soil. Hmm? There's already intent that expressed in Midogvu, which is contrary to it. Contrary to oil and soil. Because oil and soil is greater than we can understand what oil and soil is. Oil and soil does not mean oil and soil only, it means everything. 
every possibility, every truth. Who may be in so unbelievable and angry? I want to ask you a question. Chokhmah and sight knows no bounds. You open your eyes and you look out and you go all the way to no end, all the way to the sky. As you are perceiving this immense reality, Do you recognize that there are, <clears throat> that this immense, immense reality is subdivisible, subdivisible into sections? If you can see from here to the sky, can you see a mile from, a high, a mile from here? Or you can only see all the way to the, in, in, to the infinity? You cannot see to the infinity without uh, recognizing the mile, just one mile up or one yard up. And if you do not see one mile up, you only see the infinity, then you're not seeing the reality. This is the great thing about Chochmah. Chochmah is the beginning of Seichel, which means on the one hand, it, it goes all the way up, and Seichel also has recognition of the subdivisions, of the components. But in Chochman, the components are, are contained within the insert. But it's components. Now we discussed yesterday the whole mm -hmm. illustration. All right.